putting putty over the little holes where the um screws, screws were yeah, yeah. and then where they have to remove this sink which i told them already twice and they, it's still there so i'm gonna have to tell them again that that sink needs to be removed this used to be like a nail tech um shop so i'm not gonna need that sink so yes, we are um, basically covering up all those holes and these um, stuff are not going to be here. This was the previous owner's stuff. So I have like different, different type of rack that I want to use and yeah. <laughs> Um, after we finish uh, puttying the holes, we're gonna start painting. Just wanted to show you guys the before and here is gonna look completely different when I'm done with it. Trust the process. Hey guys! <laughs> OMG, you guys. It has literally been months. Since I last recorded <sighs> I don't even know where to start like it was not intentional I really 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 wanted to show you guys you know the process of me fixing up the shop and everything like that but you know I just had so much going on like keep in mind I have a nine to five as well so i had to maintain that with my home life and trying to fix up the shop in a you know designated period of time so that i could make sure and be ready but with that being said i am going to show you guys how it looks now i showed you guys um the beginning process like how it looked when i first got the keys for the shop and I think I showed you guys my happy painting and everything like that but <laughs> oh my gosh you guys let me give you guys a little tour of what's going on okay so it's almost ready you guys um I just need to do a little bit I'm just waiting on a little bit more things to get delivered so I could finalize the shop. For example, I'm waiting on um, the door wrap with the logo. So I'm gonna um, get that sometime this week. Well, today is Saturday, so sometime next week I should get it. Um, it already delivered and everything so I'm just waiting on it to arrive and I'm gonna put the wrap on the door and then you walk in and you have the little water console thingy whatever it's called water dispenser that's what it's called um, and then I have my ring light here because I had the models earlier this week I took some photos of them in the clothes so I, I think I'm gonna just leave my ring light hair to be honest um I have the TV I have this is the dressing room let me take a step back this is the dressing room and hello Um, so yes, very cute, the little rug. Um, and then I have some, um, what do you call these things? I don't even remember. A canvas, these canvases. 
super cute like designer type of you know love and then um, I had the security cameras installed so that is the system right there and then I have one camera here and one camera out here like in the hall by my door um, and then the logo well this isn't the complete logo but um my logo i'm gonna put a picture here on the screen it has like a mannequin in the middle sequence um and yeah obviously i couldn't do that and then i have don't mind these these are jeans on top of hair and pants so what i'm doing right now is putting up this stand for me to put the jeans on because I didn't want to hang them up. I prefer to have them on a stand. So like I said, I'm just doing like finalizing little stuff just to make it perfect. Um, these have like extra sizes of the clothes, these two, which I'm probably gonna have to get another one because these two are already full. Um, right here is this, the company sent me the wrong freaking size like it's a two-piece set and it came with a small top and a large bottom so I'm, I just have that hair so that I don't forget to take it back and excuse my desk it's a little messy you know I have a lot going on right now um <laughs> I have my little Moscato bottles um my lunch, my Wendy salad. And these are just some extra um, clips for the hangers that I just ordered. And under here I have the cash drawer, some extra hangers, bags, and just um, little stuff that I need under here like water and so on and so forth. I had the Wi-Fi installed already, so that's the router. I know it's a little bit dusty on top. That's from when they installed the security system, so I need to clean that off. Just a little garbage bin over there. Um, what else? This hair is another mannequin that I'm going to set up, and I'm going to explain what's going on with that in a minute. This is a little console table and I just put some cute accents on there like the lamps, the centerpiece, um, you know, and just some little accents down there just to make it cute and girly. Um, on my desk, these, this is my business card holder. Isn't this the cutest freaking thing ever? I cannot. And these are my business cards, like a frosted type of card. Super cute. Um, the pen holder, super cute as well. And you guys, the majority of these things I got from like the accents and stuff I got from Burlington and like Ross and Marshalls and stuff. But the majority, honestly, from Burlington. Like Burlington was the freaking plug throughout this whole process. This is my POS system. Um, I need to like put the stickers on there, you know, to put what type of forms of payment I accept. Um, just some hand sanitizer and stuff like that. I need to call the company. I don't know if they're gonna be open today because it's Saturday, but if not, Monday to just um, walk me through the process of you know, making sure the POS system is ready to take payments and stuff like that. And I got this cute Echo Dot Alexa speaker, whatever. It was really, really, really affordable. I got it from Amazon and it's the perfect touch. You know, I could just say Alexa, play so-and-so just to set the vibe for the whole shop. Some more canvases. 
um, I wish I had somebody here recording me so that you guys could actually see me giving the tour and not just hearing my voice, but whatever. Um, this is a cute little lounge chair. I got this from Burlington along with the throw and the two pillows from Burlington as well. All of these canvases are from Burlington and I think they just add such a cute accent for the whole shop like so freaking cute and they're all like fashion related designer you know um these like the big heavy duty stuff for example the racks and everything like that the table i got from wayfair this desk i got from a company on ebay um the two rugs i got one from ross and one from burlington um these two mirrors my friend gave me because i have one here and one in the dressing room my friend gave me these so i am truly truly happy and grateful for those um yeah and then i have these two mannequins here now the story with these um it's just awkward like i can't display some outfits on here like say i wanted to put pants and you know something with sleeves i cannot display it on that because there's no possible way that it would hold it so this mannequin over here that i showed you guys in the box that is a full body mannequin like with arms and legs and everything and yeah that's pretty much it you guys how cute is everything like i am so proud of myself yes you guys i am so proud of myself like i made a post on instagram and facebook like two days ago and the support that i got from everyone is just so overwhelming like i was so emotional and just proud you know i thank god for allowing me to actually start living my dream like honey let me just be the one to say that a nine to five is not for me and i know a lot of you guys can relate like you might be working a nine to five and just you know not happy miserable coming to work every day doing something that you don't love just to pay your bills you know and i respect that like i did it for a very long time but after a while i just realized you know i just cannot settle for this i cannot live my life unhappy coming to work every day just in a bad mood like i do not want that for myself you know and while i do still have that job um i'm going to have to try to balance it out because i am a new business owner and i don't want to just put all my eggs in one basket so it's going to be a process you guys soon i'm going to be able to look back at that job and be like a thing of the past okay on to bigger and better but with that being said my dreams are finally starting to come true although my space is small you know with small cute cozy little shop um i just wanted to you know it's a start okay and in a year i speak it on the name of jesus that I will have a huge storefront and I'm gonna look back at this video and just be like, wow, like look at how I, I started. So with that being said, I know that I didn't include you guys in the process of me actually fixing everything and you know, assembling everything, but I hope the tour made up for it. As you guys can see, this shop came a long way because the beginning was horrid that yellow wall and everything like um shout out to my hubby because he really 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 came through with the painting and he assembled everything for me like this is the first thing that i'm actually doing on my own this little table and that's super easy but he put up this desk 
and just everything like the um fitting area he put up all the paint the canvases he installed all the racks everything and i love him for that um he also put this up so love 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 um so yes you guys this is my little shop and if you guys I don't know if I mentioned it. I don't think I did. Make sure you guys follow my business page on Instagram, Raven's Closet. Spelt like this with a K. And yes, stay tuned for everything that I have in store. Um, super duper cute. If you are in the South Florida area, I have super duper duper cute hot bomb pieces okay for affordable prices you guys so with that being said thank you guys so much for tuning in and i just want to use this video as motivation for anybody that wants to start a business just go for it like just freaking go for it there's nothing you know there's nothing that can that should stop you from following your dreams Okay, with that being said, thank you so much for tuning in. You guys, make sure and stay tuned. I have some super bomb content coming up for you guys. When I say super bomb, I mean literally super bomb content coming for you guys. Thank you guys for subscribing, liking this video, and just coming on this journey with me, you guys. Bye.